Hi guys, just a quick uh, update from the Grumi Chama, the so called um, tropical cherry, one of many that I have from South America. Today I decided to give it a, a chop at the bottom and get rid of uh, many of the lower branches. And there they are. This is the first major pruning that I've given this tree in six years that I've had it. And uh, as I've said before, I like to get rid of lower branches. It, it encourages the tree to grow more upright and also to, um, well, be stronger so it's, so it's not pulled down by um, the lower weight. Um, down below so it only took me like five minutes to do this I wish every tree was five minutes that would be nice wouldn't it so the Gurumi Chama got its first uh, chop in uh, well ever since I've uh, um, had it in the ground so this, this is what I cut anything sticking side anything basically below below um, this point here anything below that right and there was like 12 branches below my fingers you don't want them that low guys so cut 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 three cuts there one down here big one there shooting straight out and a couple over on three on this side and little a few dead ones up here another one up there so altogether about a dozen about a dozen uh, branches on the Grumi Chama tropical cherry which is nice to have and uh, just thought I'd share that with you guys maybe you haven't seen a Grumi Chama pruned before especially here in a temperate climate so that's about it. Hope you enjoyed this quick one. And hopefully we get two crops out of this like we did uh, last year, both in December and again in March. All right. Thanks for watching. Remember to put a like, comment, subscribe, and also hit the bell for future notifications. Okay, guys. See you from the next video.